Hi everybody, it's time for story time with Nona and we're going to have part two of Little Black the Pony. I hope you enjoyed last week's story and we've got a really good story this week called Little Black Goes to the Circus by Walter Farley. And it's illustrated, I believe, again by James Shucker. I call my pony Little Black. He and I are good friends. Little Black will do anything for me. He will do tricks for me. He will open a gate. He will jump over things. When he is tired of tricks, he gets down. Then I get on his back and we go for rides. One day we went for a long ride. We came to a man putting up a sign. It said Bruno Circus. The circus was coming to town. Come on little black, I said. Let's see the circus. Let's see it come to town. Little black ran very fast. Soon we came to the circus tents. We saw circus wagons, then we saw circus animals and circus people. We saw Mr. Bruno. Mr. Bruno said to his men, come on, get the animals out. Then Mr. Bruno worked with the animals. He made them do tricks. He made a monkey ride on a little bike. Next, he worked with an elephant. He made that big elephant get up on a little box. Then he worked with a pony. Mr. Bruno made him walk on two feet. He made that pony walk right across the ring. All at once, Little Black jumped up. He got up on his two feet, just like the circus pony. Mr. Bruno looked up in surprise. What is this? He asked. What is going on here? Then Little Black fell down. He fell down hard. All the circus people laughed. Take that pony away, said Mr. Bruno. He's no good. He's no circus pony. Get him out of here. I took Little Black away. I had to pull him. His head was down. His tail was down. Don't be sad, Little Black. I said, you are a good pony. Mr. Bruno does not know a good pony when he sees one. I wanted to make my pony happy. Little Black, I said, let's have our own circus. I know a new trick you can do. I bet you can walk across this plank. Come on, try it. Come on, come on, don't stop. Keep going, little black. You will do it.
You did it! You are a good pony. You are just as good as any circus pony. Then Little Black pulled away. He ran. Little Black, I called. Where are you going? Come back, come back. I ran after him. I ran as fast as I could, but Little Black ran faster. He was going back to the circus. Stop, I yelled, but Little Black ran on. He ran right into the big tent. I ran into the big tent too. All the circus people were looking at something. What had happened to my pony? There he was. He was on a plank. There was Mr. Bruno too. Well, said Mr. Bruno, that pony is good. Now let's see just how good you are. Get up there, try your trick on a high plank. Oh no, don't, please Mr. Bruno, I yelled. Little Black will fall. He can't fall far, this belt will hold him. Come on, Little Black, said Mr. Bruno. Come on, hurry up. Nothing will happen. But then something did happen. Little Black fell. He did not fall far. The belt held him up. Let him down, I yelled, but they did not do it. They pulled him back up. Then everything was all right. Little Black walked right across the plank. I was glad it was all over. But it was not all over. Mr. Bruno took off the belt. Now, said Mr. Bruno, let's see you walk across that plank. Little Black started, then he stopped. Don't stop, I yelled, you will fall. Keep going, don't look down, please do as I say. Little Black did as I said. He got there, he was so happy. He got up on his two back feet. You did it, Little Black, I yelled. You did the big circus trick. Little Black came down, but I could not get near him. He had a lot of friends now. Now they did not laugh at him. Little Black said, Mr. Bruno, I will make you the star of my circus. I went out of the tent. I sat down to think. My pony wanted to stay with the circus. He wanted to be a circus star. I did not want to let him go, but I wanted him to be happy. I did not know what to do. Then I heard something. I looked up. It was Little Black. He came running out of the tent. He was running away from the circus. He was running to me.
He stopped. He got down. He wanted me to get on his back. He did not want to stay with the circus. He wanted to go home with me. We ran, we jumped, we did tricks all the way home. It was hard to tell who was happier, Little Black or I. One last jump. I hope you all enjoyed that story about Little Black. I certainly enjoyed reading them to my children and um, have lots of good memories about that. So I hope you'll join us next time. It was good of you to join me today. And I'll see you next week on Storytime with Nona. Bye.